Hello YouTube, aka Soggy Buns here. Today I want to talk about some uh, five cool Arduino projects that you could do potentially on a Raspberry Pi. The overview of this video, uh, we will potentially we will look at potential Raspberry Pi projects that are adapted from Arduino projects. These are just a few ideas that I think would be sweet to do on a Raspberry Pi. So let's start with number five. Number five is an LED Gmail notifier. What it would do is you'd use the Pi's GPIO pins to turn on, illuminate, spin, fly when you receive an email. This could be a neat desk ornament. Uh, the Pi can easily access the Gmail or any other I APIs that you would like to do. And that leads us to number four, a robot who reads Twitter. Now I know this has been done with the Pi Face, with the Pi Face developers. They use the Python script to uh, use the Twitter API and then uh, connecting the GPIO pins to the robot they have it read and shake and spin to Twitter. Uh, this could also have been used with your Gmail notifier. I think you could use this for many APIs. I think this would be very cool with the Raspberry Pi. One of the very useful things I think for a hobbyist with the Raspberry Pi. Uh, the Pi could access the Twitter account and read it whenever a new tweet appears and you could even build different robots. That's why I like that second robot uh, in this picture. Number three, a red, green, blue combination door lock. Uh, you can have the different combinations uh, to lock your to, for your lock to let you into your house, your room, your locker. You could use it to lock almost anything. Uh, they used an Arduino to do this, but a Raspberry Pi could easily, very easily do this. I think this would be a neat little project. Number two, an etch a sketch clock. Now you'd use the Raspberry Pi's GPIO pins and a Python script to control an etch a sketch to have it sketch the time. Uh, now the Raspberry Pi would have to work really fast to do this but it'd be very cool you could use it to display the time or whatever you would want uh, you could have it uh, one neat idea is you could have it be like uh, one of those digital uh, photo frames have it read the, the picture and then sketch on the etch sketch this would be a very cool idea I think it's a very uh, cool decoration for the house that you could use to utilize the, the Pi and number one a remote controlled lawnmower. You could use the Raspberry Pi for the brain instead of an Arduino. It could be solar pow powered. You could have it be real com remote controlled. You could have it be remote controlled with like a uh, game controller or your phone or a regular remote control with the frequencies. Uh, you could even have it follow a pattern. Uh, have the Raspberry Pi coded uh, to have dimensions of your backyard and have it actually follow that pattern and uh, be fully automated. I think it would be fully autonomous. I think this would be very, very cool. Uh, very neat project that you could do with the Raspberry Pi. I would love to see someone do this. Uh, I think that's the neat thing about the Raspberry Pi is there's just so many uses for it. And that's why I made this video just kind of brainstorm a little more. So let us know. Let us know if you ever do this. Uh, comment. Let us give us the, uh, the link to wherever you post your videos or blogs or anything. If you ever do or have done uh, anything with Raspberry Pi for this. Like, subscribe. Uh, also, here are some of the URLs from where I got the ideas of where they use Arduinos for these projects and how we could uh, potentially use them for Raspberry Pi. I'll put these in the description below. Uh, again, rate, subscribe, comment. Thank you.